The soul is the mind, the will, and emotions of a person. Soul ties refer to a strong intimate bonding relationship between two or more people. The Bible does not use the term or phrase soul ties. It does however use the word knit to describe a relationship between David and Jonathan's soul. But a soul ties or knit are spiritual covenant relationship between two individuals that takes place, legally to intimate connections, emotional connections, and spiritual experiences. It is a relationship where your soul stays connected to the person beyond a physical relationship. Life is spiritual, and because of that, we have to understand the spiritual consequences of all our actions. There are godly soul ties when like-minded believers are together in the Lord, like David and Jonathan. In 1 Samuel 18 verse 1, the Bible tells us, Now when he had finished speaking to Saul, the soul of Jonathan was knit to the soul of David, and Jonathan loved him as his own soul. Godly soul ties that develop between a husband and a wife within a marriage is a covenant in the will of God. When a man and a woman marries, the Bible says the two are joined together and become one flesh. This joining together happens in a spiritual way, and the two souls become one within the marriage covenant. Ephesians 5 verse 31 tells us, Therefore a man shall leave his father and mother and hold fast to his wife, and the two shall become one flesh. This one flesh they are speaking of, this is not a physical joining together, but a spiritual one. They are ungodly soul ties. When a man and a woman sleeps around, the Bible tells us it is ungodly. 1 Corinthians 6 verse 15 to 20 tells us, Don't you realize that your bodies are actual parts of Christ? Should a man take his body, which is part of Christ, and join it to a prostitute? Never. And don't you realize that if a man join himself to a prostitute, he becomes one body with her? For the scripture says, the two are united into one. But the person who is joined to the Lord is one spirit with him. Run from sexual sin. No other sin so clearly affects the body as this one does. For sexual immorality is a sin against your own body. Don't you realize that your body is the temple of the Holy Spirit who lives in you and was given to you by God? You do not belong to yourself, for God brought you with a price. So you must honor God with your body. Every time a person has sex outside of marriage, ungodly soul ties are established and the demons are giving rise for entry. The deeper the person enters into such immoral relationships, the stronger the demonic holes enters the person, and this can become a gateway for further and sometimes extensive demonic attacks. Ungodly soul ties can be formed through seducing spirit that are always involved when sexual sins are committed. This is why we are warned to flee from sexual immorality. Ungodly soul ties can be created through unhealthy codependent, domineering or controlling relationships with family members. Family relationships that are governed by witchcraft, domination, intimidation, manipulation, and through control. Ungodly soul ties can happen through occult involvement. When a person has become involved in Ouija board, divination, witchcraft, the new age, or it can be something that has occurred generationally from your mother or father's side and now is producing fruit in the life of the person with dull memories, disturbed sleep, internal declarations, turmoils, accidents, financial reverses, unexplained illnesses, or illnesses that do not respond to treatment. How do you break ungodly soul ties? If you think you have an issue with sins that were committed to cause these soul ties, repent of them now. Fornication is perhaps one of the most common ways to create ungodly soul ties and evil confident. I will still encourage you to get rid of anything that symbolizes the ungodly sexual practice you took part with in the relationship. Ungodly soul ties should be renounced and repented and be broken in Jesus' name. Even things like, I will love you forever, I could never love any other man, need to be renounced. There are spoken commitments that need to be undone verbally. As Proverbs 21 verse 23 tells us, Whoever guard his mouth and tongue keep his soul from trouble. The tongue has the ability to bring the soul great troubles and bondage. Tonight before we pray, List the people you are seeking to break soul ties with. This list will include all persons you have been sexually intimate with, including intercourse, oral sex, or anal sex, and anyone you have been deeply wounded by, and anyone who tried to control you. These relationships create bondages and ownership issues that must be dealt with in order for you to experience freedom. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, I pray you'll forgive my sins for things done or undone, known and unknown in Jesus' name. Lord Jesus Christ, I ask that all soul ties, attachment, connection, 
bends and bonds, chains and cords, wires and pipes, and anything that links me to an ungodly soul ties with these people be broken tonight in the name of Jesus. Father, any soul ties that I have with any human spirits, any witch, any warlock, any satanism, any Satan, any occultist, any spirits, any things known and unknown, I ask that they will now be permanently be removed and destroyed with the sword of the Spirit and sealed with the blood of Jesus so that they can never be reopened again. I ask that the severing and sealing occur in the natural, in the spirit, in every other realm, known and unknown. I pray that all connection between me and any past sexual partner, any close emotional relationships, any occult involvement be nullified tonight by the blood of Jesus. Lord, I ask that everything that have been deposited, inserted, and placed in me, including my body, my soul, my spirit, my mind, my will, my emotions, my memory, my conscious and subconscious mind, I pray that these things will be permanently removed by your angels tonight in Jesus' name. I ask that all things of mine, including all stolen and forfeited physical and spiritual properties, my destiny, virtues, any gifts, any things, known and unknown, in any realm, held by ungodly soul tie, be returned to me now in the mighty name of Jesus. As it concerns people who I have sexual relationships with, masturbated to, had sexual fantasies and no dreams about, and all who have filthy dreams and fantasies about me and spiritual encounters with me, I specifically ask that all connection between this individual and all their associates, sexual and other partners, past, present, and future, will be cut as well so that they have no connection to me. I also ask all ties to friends of friends, family, and all other ties and all indirect ties be completely severe tonight as well in Jesus' name. Father, release your angels to perform these actions now rapidly and continuously until I am scrubbed clean of all ungodly soul ties, influences, and connections. Please cleanse and scrub my mind, my will, my emotions, my memory, my conscious and subconscious mind of all evil voices, influences, and residue. Please restore my soul and anything that has been taken from me. I now break all curses that have come upon me from being associated with the ungodly soul ties and with the blood of Jesus. I now break the power of all incantation, rituals, and evil practices associated with the ungodly soul ties over me with the blood of Jesus. Lord, please set me apart from the world and make me clean in body, soul, and spirit. Set me apart from you and your work. I thank you and praise you, Lord, for the freedom that will result. Lord, I pray that the Holy Spirit will bring to mind the things that you will want me to add to this list for my complete and total freedom in the future by bringing it to mind. Any faces, any names, and anything you will have me to renounce. I plead the blood of Jesus upon my spirit, my soul, my body, now in Jesus' name. I apply the blood of Jesus to break all demonic yokes in my life in Jesus' name. Lord, have mercy and forgive me for all my sins in Jesus' name. I bind every demon assigned to enforce any evil confident in my life in Jesus' name. I command the strong forces behind any relationships to catch fire in the name of Jesus. I command the strong forces behind my relationship and marriage to catch fire in the name of Jesus. I bind any demon attached to this soul tie with this person in Jesus' name. Let all ungodly soul ties with my ex whom I had sex with to break by fire in the name of Jesus. If we stop an altar operating in my life as a result of this ungodly relationship, break by fire in Jesus' name. Any power that is using my blood against my marriage, dry up spiritually in Jesus' name. I break and loose myself from every collective curses in the name of Jesus. Blood of Jesus, break the stronghold of the wicked upon my life tonight in Jesus' name. I refuse to be controlled by any evil confident of my father's house in Jesus' name. I withdraw my glory from any man or woman using it to shine in Jesus' name. All my lost virtue come back to me tonight in Jesus' name. I command all foundational strongmen attached to my life to be paralyzed in the name of Jesus. I renounce every conscious and unconscious ungodly covenant with the dead in the name of Jesus. I renounce every ungodly covenant binding on me as a result of my sexual feelings with my past sexual activities. I command you to break in the name of Jesus. I break every sexual agreement between me and any past lovers in Jesus' name. Anything in my life gotten from my ex-boyfriend or ex-girlfriend that is causing sorrow in my life, I shake it out of me tonight in Jesus' name. All the money, all the clothes, and other gifts collected from my ex that is binding my soul to him or her be destroyed in Jesus' name. Every situation introduced into my destiny by foundational idol power rose in the name of Jesus Christ. Any marine power binding my soul to the water or tree expire tonight in Jesus' name. 
I cancel the verdict of the wicked upon my life in Jesus' name. Three soul tie, I break you by fire in the name of Jesus. Every evil soul tie with money, break by fire in the name of Jesus. I cancel the nickname my ex gave me in Jesus' name. Blood of Jesus, destroy every inherited covenant from my ex in the name of Jesus. Every word changed from my ex-boyfriend or girlfriend, binding me to him or her, break by fire in the name of Jesus. Every curse of unprofitable love affair afflicting my virtues be broken in Jesus' name. O oh God, deliver my soul from the strong men tonight in Jesus' name. I break and lose myself from every collective evil covenant in the name of Jesus. You, my glory, hear the word of the living God. You must not cooperate with my enemies tonight in the name of Jesus. I release myself from the grip of any problem transferred into my life from the womb in the name of Jesus. Any power attacking me through my destiny to this man or woman, go back to sender in the name of Jesus. Every ungodly relationship causing delay in my life, break by fire tonight in the name of Jesus. I break the ungodly attachment between my soul and the spirit of my ex in Jesus' name. Every curse that has come upon me as a result of the unbreakable covenant, I command you to break by fire in Jesus' mighty name. I break this soul tie and renounce every unholy part of the bond in Jesus' name. Every hating and unknown covenant troubling my destiny, in the name of Jesus, I break you tonight. I break every covenant of death speaking against me, in Jesus' name. Every oath that I have taken to any ungodly covenant in my life and marriage, let the blood of Jesus reverse such oath and unseal any ungodly covenant tonight, in Jesus' name. Let the blood of Jesus destroy the foundation of any evil covenant operating in my life, in Jesus' name. Let the fire of the Holy Ghost consume everything in me that is not of God in Jesus' name. Let every evil effect of any demonic covenant in my life be erased by the blood of Jesus. Every evil covenant that is working against my advancement break by the anointing in Jesus' name. Every evil chain linking me to family idol I command you to break tonight in Jesus' name. I destroy every covenant binding me to the wrong people tonight in the name of Jesus. Let the activities of any evil covenant in my life cease from this moment on in Jesus' name. Any covenant between me and powers of waters, rocks, sun, the moon, break in Jesus' name. Covenant between me and any idol and evil spirit, break by fire in Jesus' name. I break and cancel every covenant with any idol and the yokes attached to it in the name of Jesus. I break every ungodly covenant between me and the dead relatives in the name of Jesus. I break every ungodly covenant with evil birds in the name of Jesus. I destroy every ungodly soul tie covenant between me and any herbalist. I remove all my control manipulation between me and my friends, my family members, or any evil authority figure in the name of Jesus. I claim deliverance from any negative affection towards anyone tonight in Jesus' name. Let every evil affection towards me be wiped off the mind in the name of Jesus. I break and renounce you in the name of Jesus. Evil soul tie that I have had with any family member, any past and present friends, any sorcerers and witch, any ex-spouses, any preachers, any evil authority figures, any spirit spouses, any evil societies, any religious leaders or dead relatives and dead friends, any marine kingdom or witchcraft or familiar spirit, any spirit of demotion, any demonic caterers, any spirit of poverty, spirit of infirmity and sickness, spirit of insanity, spirit of death and graveyard spirit. Blood of Jesus, remove, cleanse, and purge the effect of every ungodly soul tie away from my life and destiny tonight in Jesus' name. I claim my complete deliverance from all negative affection towards anyone living or dead tonight in Jesus' name. Blood of Jesus, wash away all witchcraft and writing in my life tonight in the name of Jesus. By the power in the blood of Jesus, I submit my affection, my emotions, my desire to the control of the Holy Spirit. Lord, your words say that you will restore my soul. Loose your angels to remove anything in me, my body, my soul, and spirit that should not be there. Father, loose your angel to bring back and restore any part of me, my mind, my will, and emotion that has been fragmented and restore it, especially my memory, gifts, and anything else that you deem important. I pray that you will replace every image in me with the image of Christ. Replace every sound with the sound of Christ. Replace every word with the word of Christ. Replace every thought with the thought of Christ. I now bind my mind to the mind of Christ, my will to the will of God, and my feet to the narrow path. I thank you, Father, for honoring this prayer today. Thank you for releasing me from every soul tie that is ungodly. Thank you for canceling every false title, any note or lean against me. Thank you for overturning every false verdict against me and replacing it with righteous verdict. And thank you for releasing me from every false accusation. 
Father, we grace your angels to take every ungodly soul taught in my life, remove them, and burn them tonight forever in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Amen.